Tin Tin Ho is Great Britain's most promising young table tennis player. The 16-year-old is the reigning under-21 national champion. And last year, she announced herself on the international stage by winning a silver medal at the Commonwealth Games. To find out more about the talented teenager, Transworld Sport headed to Bayswater in West London, where she lives and trains. My first tournament was when I was six. I think it was at London Youth Games. And I just remember just relaxing and just, I didn't really care about winning or losing. I was just, I was just there, so it was quite fun. Tintin is coached by her dad, Charles, himself a former table tennis player who competed for Hong Kong. He named his daughter Tintin as he liked the fact that the initials TT also stand for table tennis. His eldest son is also associated with the sport, having been called Ping after the term ping pong. When I was in Hong Kong, uh, when I was um, a child, um, younger than her, I started playing the table tennis on a stone floor and we used a chalk to mark out a table and we play on, on the ground. I'd say her love for table tennis initially came from my dad and all this equipment that we have in our house. So I think that was the, the initial push. But then since she started to win a lot of tournaments and since she started getting quite competitive, I think that drives her as well, because it's quite nice to have something to strive for that you're good at. Tintin's brother Ping represented England at youth level before taking the decision to focus on his law studies. But he still often finds the time to act as her hitting partner. No, I love practicing with Tintin. It's really great fun because I really see how much she progresses. Um, but she is getting very, very fast. Probably a bit too fast for me. Um, but yeah, it, it's, it's very enjoyable playing with her. Dad Charles has a clear coaching philosophy that he hopes will equip his daughter with the tools necessary to challenge the leading exponents of the game from China in the years ahead. Chinese players have won every single gold medal on offer at the last two Olympics. There are four aspects to become a very good player. Uh, a technique, a mental uh, ability, physical strength and tactics. Well, in table tennis, or in all sports, I think the mental aspect is quite important as it's just uh, quite hard to like pick yourself up after a bad loss or just to keep going. Um, but in table tennis specifically, I think I think the movement is very important to have good power on your legs and also like, your reflex and um, the amount of spin and stuff that you put on the ball is all important. Tintin's favourite player is the Chinese star Wang Hao. He plays with a penhold grip, a style which Tintin has also adopted. I play with penhold, uh, it's quite a traditional Chinese style. Um, and I use short movements on my forehand, which gives a different uh, variation than normal rubber. And then I also use, I just use normal rubber on my backhand, a reverse rubber, which is so I, I can spin the board more. And, stuff. and I'm, I stay quite close to the table and, and attack. Tintin is currently studying for her school exams and has successfully learned to juggle her schoolwork with her sport. When she does get some time to herself, the youngster enjoys whiling away the hours by drawing. The hardest part is, uh, for me personally, is probably uh, um, keeping the right balance with schoolwork and table tennis, as I'd like to um, do well in my studies as well as table tennis. Tintin practices at home where her father has constructed a designated training area for his daughter on the ground floor of the house. Another of her training partners is former Commonwealth champion Mike O'Driscoll, and the pair go through some gruelling sessions at the table. I usually train six times a week, uh, sometimes seven, depending on like school work and stuff. Um, usually I just play at home or at my club with a friend or um, a coach. 
and usually it's just uh, exercises on, on the table, but I also have to do quite a lot of physical stuff, so maybe like running, skipping, speed work, power. Tintin competes for Middlesex in regional competitions around the country. And the 16-year-old is currently third in the English senior women's rankings. It feels great to be ranked highly. Uh, I hope I can get to number one in uh, uh, woman one day, but yeah, it feels, um, yeah, it gives me a lot of confidence to be number one in the juniors. Transworld Sport accompanied Tintin to the recent English National Table Tennis Championships, which took place at the Redbridge Sports and Leisure Centre in East London. Tintin went into the tournament as the top-ranked under-21 player in Britain and was aiming to reaffirm that status here. In the final, she faced her doubles partner, Maria Satsinos. Having lost the under-21 title to Maria last year, Tintin was on a mission to regain it, but she faced a tough opponent. However, Tintin soon found her rhythm and claimed the opening two sets. In the third set, Tintin continued to manoeuvre her opponent around the table with the speed and aggression that has come to characterise her game. quickly reached match point and went on to secure an impressive straight set victory over her good friend and rival. We always have really tough matches because we know each other's games a lot and we always play each other and we're also quite close so it's always tough. Tin Tin Ho, a table tennis name for the future. Subscribe now to our YouTube channel for the very best of Transworld Sports.